Good evening, Padres fans, and welcome to the fourth qualifier match of this year's Galactic Pod Racing Championship. I'm here with my co-commentator, Balmas. Lovely to meet y'all. And today we have Leaf Green Sniper, Metallica 5167, and Dwy Guy. These three racers will be attempting to qualify for anywhere on our bracket going into the final lineup for the tournament this year. Now, the way this works is that we will have three races. This first one, Aquilaire's Classic, Fire Mountain Rally, and Ando Prime Centrum. Each, ra each racer will have 15 minutes in which to set the best time they can. Infinite restarts, just the only important thing is that you get the best time you can. That's right, 15 minutes for this track, 30 for Fire Mountain Rally, and 15 again for Ando Prime Centrum. Now, this is one race where I'm not sure whose stream to look at because there's a reason to look at everyone. Metallica is a returning veteran of the previous two tournaments. An extremely talented, extremely strong racer placed, I think, at the top five both times the last two years running. Leaf Green Cypher, a local boy, a late entry. Looking forward to seeing what he can do. I have not watched any of his streams, so I'm very, I'm very, you know, looking forward to it. And Dwy Guy is looking to bop knock and take her spot as number 16 in the bracket. That's absolutely right. So what you're going to want to do is focus your left eye on Leaf Green, your right <laughs> eye on Metallica, and open your third eye to watch Dwy Guy. It's very important. Now Metallica, I'm really very interested here because there's no chance he's not going to qualify. The question is, is he going to get one of the coveted top eight spots in the upper bracket? It, 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 to do so, he needs to bop Nacho's times. Or is he going to get bumped down to the lower bracket? Up, oh, looks like we have a restart from Dwy Guy. I think we're off. Oh boy, it begins. Let's start, Let's start that 15 minute timer. Now, there's a little bit of a delay, so the timer on my end is not gonna be their timer, but everyone should have a 15 minute timer up. As I said, you have 15 minutes in which to set your best time. Now, I'm gonna be the, looking um, at Metallica here. He's gonna be doing what's probably gonna be the cleanest line we're gonna see in this race. Absolutely. Um, I'll be keeping my eyes on Leaf Green and Dwy to see how they're doing in comparison to each other. Ooh, crash from Leaf Green. Ooh, nasty. That's a good start. Um, it's very important to get a banker time as early as you can so that you can actually work on improving with no added stress. And the reason for that is because in this game, in order to go fast, what you want to do is you want to cut each corner as close as possible. You want to take the shortest line in the track, because in this game, there's no loss of speed when you turn. As exactly. Such, the fastest line is going to be cutting each corner as close as you possibly can to the wall. As you can see Metallica riding up that hill in order to get closer to the wall. The problem is the walls are where death happens. So, yeah, generally speaking, touching them is a little bit on the uh, don't do it side. So the things that will make you go fast are usually also the things that kill you. What doesn't kill you makes you faster. Ooh, but Ooh, that will Unlike that, green. that does not. Leaf Green opting to restart after two crashes. That's fair, that's fair. Um, stream delay, by the way, does appear to be about one minute. So when I give the runners the uh, the mark to stop running, there will be about one more minute of them attempting to get AQC times before uh, everybody stops. Metallica with a 52-56 second lap. Ooh, He's gosh, on track for around 236, 237, somewhere there. 237, I think. Metallica's on pretty good pace. Like, mm. I'm very impressed. Why is on lap three? I Do I hear music? Whose audio are we using? Did we make a mistake? Hold on, that's a problem. Almost, do you have the uh, audio open? Can you switch to a runner who doesn't have music going? Sure, let me... Um... Wait, hold on. I'm hearing things. I'm insane. <laughs> Never mind. I'm using Leaf Green Cypher, it's fine. 
Oh, shoot. No, I'm not insane. There yeah, is audio. Metallica, Metallica 237.421. Excellent time. I'm not insane. We do need to change off of whoever we got right now because we've got um, we got music going. That'll get us copyright claimed. I switched it to Dwight Guy. There we go. Dwight has no music. There we go. That's fine. Good. We saved it. We're fine. Now, Aqualaris Classic is one of those classic tracks we recommend to every new player. It's excellent at teaching fundamentals. And so this is going to be an incredibly tight race. Right now, the difference between the top player and the bottom player in the races that have been run is around four seconds. Very tight groupings all the way around. That is absolutely right. The groupings are incredibly tight this year. There's really so many good players in this year's tournament that finding anybody to be the bottom bracket is is hard. <laughs> oh, I absolutely feel that. The brackets this year are full of astonishingly good players. It is just incredible how many players have come either out of retirement or just for, are doing this for fun. I'm not even angry that I'm probably not going to be able to participate just because I get to see all the people who are so good at this game. That is absolutely right. I believe I've been knocked out of quals by uh, by Knock in her qualifier match last week or so, Ooh, right? Le Leaf on fire on lap three. That is not what you want. You want to be able to maximize that boost. Yeah, you definitely don't want to catch fire there. You're supposed to do that as you cross the line, Leaf. Very important to get that in your head. Um, oh, I should be keeping an eye on Twitch chat as well. 244, I can't quite catch that. 244.39 for Leaf Green. Did did I finish a run? Yeah, 244.39 is Leaf Green sniper time right now. Uh, I'm going to make sure he knows how this works by typing in the text channel that he can continue. Thank you, Pistol. 244.392. Oh, no, wait, no, he's got it. He's, he's still going, I just wanted to make sure. Um, yep, I got Twitch chat open, I'm keeping an eye on them. And if I minimize Discord, I can shrink it and get our restream over top of where the Twitch stream goes. 237.186 from Metallica, incredible. Wow. Let me is that a, check my score. Wait, is that a 27? Here? That's a 37, right? Yeah. Good. That is faster than Nacho Bredo, so he is officially outperforming Nacho right here. Just needs to do that once more in the other two races to bop Nacho. I apologize, Lightning, for narrating things only I can see. I'm <laughs> just trying to get everything set up the right way for my own benefit. I should have done that first. That's on me. Oh, nasty crash for Metallica. How's Dwight doing down there on the on the bottom? Did Dwight get has a time Dwight earlier? Has finished a time yet? I don't think he has. He was on lap three. If he reset, then that's uh, unfortunate. But I, I saw a lap yeah. three from him earlier. I don't know if I saw an actual time come through. Oh, wait, no. Uh, we got word coming in. Dwight has a 243.06 right now. 243.06. Run that down. Who runs already? Wow, we are not paying enough attention. <laughs> A little wide there, Dwight, going into doors, but very important to at least survive. Leaf you tend to set better times when you don't die. <laughs> Leaf with a, with a 53 on lap two. That's actually really impressive for a new player. That's super impressive. Incredible pace. I'm going to actually mute the episode one racer server for an hour. Sorry. <laughs> yeah, she really impressed with Leaf so far, showing a lot of promise. They know, he, he the knows what he needs to do to go fast. He just needs to do it more consistently. And KBB, also, please advise, what do you mean watching the qualifying sheet for times? <laughs> 
Whoa! I have no idea what that was. Fun little visual error there. 242.44 is That's an improvement by two bad. seconds. That's not bad at all. Let's see what those last three numbers are. Oh, Dwight guy coming up on his lap three. Let's see what he gets. Oh, he gets a crash. <laughs> Do we got that number written down? 242.435. Uh, on Leaf, I should say. Yeah. Uh, also, Dwight, oh no, Dwight, that dies. hurts. Oh, that hurts so bad. Heartbreak like for I've Dwight done that on the last lap, Draco. and it hurts every time. Heartbreaker too. I thought I needed that. Dwight guy playing it careful through the doors there. All right, we are approaching the five minute mark by my timer. Dwy Guy still needs to set a time that is better than Nox if he wants to be in the bracket. Right now, Nox has a 238.683, so Dwy needs to shave almost two seconds off his time right now. Between Dwy and Leaf Green, at least, it's been very close. Metallica, however, has been absolutely destroying everything. <laughs> yeah, look at how close he's shaving those corners. Holy crap. This is this is a, a pretty big, um, a pretty good way to visualize the difference between good players like Leaf Green and Dwy and the higher end of our of our uh, playing group nope. like Metallica. Metallica passing flag safely. There we go. Bye, Clegg. Thanks for opening oh, the doors, he's buddy. A, he's a blisteringly fast pace as Metallica. Let's see what he gets. This is an absolutely cracked pace from him. You're right. Two thirty-seven oh eight. Nice. Uh, I don't think it's faster, is it? Uh, he had a two thirty-six, two thirty-seven one five six. So he shaved almost a uh, two tenths of a second there. Oh, okay, that is faster. Ah, dang. Point oh eight four. Holy wow! Oh, um. Also, I have information for you, which will be useful. We don't have to be writing this down on pencil and paper. We're not cavemen. I saw it. Yeah, don't worry. Metallica is definitely gunning for Hellfire's time. 239.687 from from Dwy, very nice. 239, Dwy, that's incredible. <laughs> Aiming for the DU pop? <laughs> that's... Hmm. Thanks, chat. I mean, just so long as he doesn't bop me, I'm fine with that. <laughs> Did you actually beat me on this one? I don't remember. I did by, by, not by much, but not enough to matter. You beat me the other two times, so you're, you're still above me. Should be noted there are potential plans in the work for a, a, a third amateur bracket with slightly different rules being broadcast on a different channel. There will be more information about that as things develop. Um, I don't know who to watch right now. Well, we have oh, just under two minutes and 30 seconds on the timer, so we have time for one more one more complete run. Although oh, yeah. you started your timer based on stream time. I started mine based on real time. Uh, so they've, they've got one minute 19 left, according to my time. Although Metallica has a timer in his corner, it says 202.
Metallica's timer must be slightly out of sync from mine. I don't know who to watch. It's it's hard to choose. Uh, Metallica is on lap three, but uh, Leaf Green is coming up on the end of a second lap, so we'll probably want to switch from Leaf Green to Metallica. Ooh, and, and a nasty bonk in that hairpin. That's where you're gonna lose most of your most of your time on this lap. Figure eight, not hairpin. Interesting to note, Leaf Green is the only player right now on console as opposed to PC. I think, right? Yeah, the other two have uh, that nice little fuzz going on from running an old computer game. That Leaf Green is, is playing on the true. PlayStation Four. Crypto is normally on console, but he hasn't entered this year. Two thirty seven point two three is not Crypto better than what he has. Sorry, I thought, I thought Crypto entered. Uh, he's not on the sheet. I don't think. That is that audible for you guys? Uh, dog, it's all right. All right, guys. All right, Leaf coming up to three of three. Oh, that's my timer. I'm gonna leave a message in general. Two forty-two point three two and a lap record. Nicely done, Leaf. These should definitely be the last few runs coming in. Well, remember, stream delay is about a one more run if he wants to. Definitely, depends on what happens next. Dwight coming up to the end. Looks like Leaf's taking it. What do we see? Ooh. It's another 239. I saw 0.37, but I didn't see the end screen. What was that? I think it was 3... 336 was the end screen. Yeah, no, Goof, I know they've got the full, the full 15 minutes. There's just like a minute of stream delay. Yep, we are I'm... on the last runs for Metallica and Dwy, so let's see what they can do. You forget, Goof, I'm partly responsible for this being the way that it is. <laughs> I, uh, I accidentally did a run that was a little bit later than the old rules would have allowed for, but then Goof realized that the old rules effectively cut our timer short by one minute, which defeated the purpose of having a 15 minute timer if you're just going to only be able to use 14 minutes of it. All right, Metallica's gonna be, yep, there's Clegg passing safely, nicely done. Let's see what these two can pull off in this last amount of time. All right, let's take an interesting Metallica. line through doors. It's, um, it's not the theoretically fastest Ooh. line, but it is an all right line to take. 237.15, unfortunate. Took a wide through, through that chicane there. That was un unfortunate. Okay, Dwyer, what you gonna get? Oh wait, no, you got one more lap. <laughs> I'm getting hyped up, ready to see a time, and there's, there's one more lap left for Dwyer. 53.06 is a respectable lap too. It is. It is quite a respectable lab, too. Uh, I'm going to find my 30-minute timer and be ready with that for Fire Mountain Rally, which is our next track. Um, oh, you make me nervous with those doors, Dwight. Definitely. The line Dwight is taking isn't quite the optimal one. Um, yep. Partially because Dwy is not taking Clegg to keep the doors open in the optimal positions. Oh, I hadn't noticed that. Yeah, you're right. Oh no, you need you you need to be boosting in in in, in, in the chicane here. Thirty nine point four two one. That oh, is a well. pretty good time though. Yeah, uh, that, that's very, that's I don't a very think good it's time. Faster. I don't think it's faster, but it is pretty good. It is not. 
Okay. All right, we are getting set up on Fire Mountain Rally, which is, oh, oh man, this track. It's the second hardest track in the game. It is the longest in terms of time, and that's because it's one of two tracks in the game where Bullseye Noir's faster turning traction and repair is more important than the speed you get from Ben's drag racer, yeah. Now, it is worthy of note that Hellfire would debate you on that and very much tried to prove that in their qualifier. It's, it's, a, it's a tough debate. There's a case for it, but at a human level, Bullseye is much easier. Bullseye is easier and more reliable, I think is the more important note, in a tourney where consistency is rewarded far more than potential IL fastest speed. Bullseye is incredibly twitchy and incredibly fragile. So he's very small, very narrow, likes to fit in through the, into those small spaces. So you really need to take those corners tight. And everything I said about getting to the walls is dangerous as, as Ben, you know, triple that for Bullseye. Bullseye is one of the most fragile characters in all of video gaming. Whoops, there's the um. corner. It is also worth noting that for um, Leaf Green Sniper, this is uh, a little bit of a disadvantage state. Bullseye tends to have high traction on PC already at any frame rate, and the PlayStation 4 version of the game is locked at around 60. So because of the vagaries of traction frames per second, yada yada, tourney falsehoods per second, same mistakes we make every year explaining this stuff, Leaf Green's got a little bit less slick in his tires. That is true, and you really want that slick in this track especially, because that will let you take those turns more tightly. Not as frequently because of the way traction works in this game. Go ahead and pull out your, bull your, your bingo cards and mark off commentator talked about TFPS there. But yeah, this is going to be... A tough track for him. The only thing that really needs to be said about TFPS for everybody to get it is that traction is dependent on frame rate, and it wasn't supposed to be. It tries its hardest not to be, but they cancel out frame time in the math, so it ends up creating a little bit of a wonky situation. Well, it begins. And we're off. Now, as I said, this is the longest track in the game in terms of time. So we're gonna, probably going to see times from around 5, five minutes to 5.15 for Metallica. Respectable is around 5.10, and the record set this, set this year by Domeray is 501.619. That is correct. Uh, Dom was cracked during tourney quals. I, I don't he know was. if anything could have really shaken Dom any further than... You know, his you know, his normal state of slightly tilted. Ooh, Leaf taking some nasty bops in the forest, which makes sense with that with that traction, as we said. I wonder what traction part Leaf is using. I don't think we've been able to see any of Leaf Green's upgrades during the course of this. Taking the wider track around the lava, normally want to cut down. Ooh, a little bit of a scrape there. Oh, Leaf, cutting across the lava is risky. That increases your heat and it's slow terrain. And that, importantly, that slow terrain goes all the way up, all the way to the, to, from the bottom map, all the way up to the sky. So you cannot dodge that if you're going over it. The slightly wrong way around. The heat increase goes all the way to the top of the map. The slow terrain is only if you drive on it. Okay. I think, right? Confirm or deny? Uh, yeah, slow terrain doesn't affect you midair. Goof brush. Thank you. Okay. <laughs> but consider, cutting across the lava reduces your underheat, so it's all good. Uh, not sure that works. I don't that think way. that's quite how it works. Who is Dom? A very good question. Domeray SSB is our fastest runner right now. I've given you his YouTube handle, but uh, Domeray is the fastest runner in the game right now. He's got, uh, what is it? How many records do we have? 50? 50 out of 50 yeah. world records? Yeah, is Dom's got 50 I, out I, of 50 world records right now, I think. Um, is he or at very least he did for a while. One. Goof might have taken one, I don't remember. Um, 
That's why I said at very least Dom had 50 out of 50 for a while. Yeah. Like a good while. Dom is definitely the, well, I guess you might say the track favorite for the entire tournament right now. Yeah, he's the one to beat. Ooh, he's got 25 full track three laps right now. Yeah, that's that's right. Thank you. I bet on Tom. He always wins. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man, this track is just hypnotic to watch because it's just. Oh, there's so much to comment on, but so nothing I can actually say. I'm just, you know, awestruck by, the, by these runners. Yeah, I get oh, mind wow, flooded racing fast. this track. That was a fast shortcut for Metallica. Holy crap. I missed it. I, I get mind flooded just racing this track. So imagine trying to commentate and talk over it at the same time. The only benefit is that I'm not currently trying to control this as well. <laughs> slightly, sh slightly slower shortcut from Leaf. I missed Dwy Guy there. 143 from Metallica. Wow. Ooh. Bonk on the corner. How do you commentate on something so fast? Well, it helps if you've ever been a cattle auctioneer, which neither of us have. So, you know, we've got some problems there. Um, uh, Leaf Green Sniper has frozen. frozen. For me. That's great. Um, oh, it woke back up and it's frozen Briefly. and it woke back up. Everything seems OK. Oops, Metallica catching some air on that jump Ooh. there. You don't want to do that. You want to slide across and make sure you make sure you don't stay as flat as possible. Absolutely. Oof. Oh, no, not quite. I'm sitting there watching you leave and go like, oh, I'm just waiting for the crash to happen here. Watch you missed the one from Dwight earlier. Job. I think that of all the tracks Leaf was practicing recently, this was like the one he was going hardest on. It was either this or AQC was uh, Leaf's muse most recently, if I want to say. Oh man, here's where you see the skill difference here. You can see that Metallica and Leaf are at about the same time, or at around that five minute mark, but Metallica is an entire volcano and cheese land and almost half the city ahead. It's it's an insane difference between, you know, a good runner and a great runner. 51409, what's that last number? 085. Dang. Uh, wow. Blazing speed from Metallica. Always a pleasure to see a time like that get recorded. And this means that Metallica is officially taking Nacho's spot because that's two races out of three that he's gotten better. Nacho's time was 52148. That's an, that's a whole six seconds down. I'm not sure if that's entirely how it works. It is points based this year. There's like a weird world in which Metallica absolutely destroys uh, their chances on APC, like just completely flubs it. But it's unlikely. That's true. Yeah, it, it is technically possible. Casual 40 seconds faster than the other two. Uh, that is why it is good that qualifiers are not directly competitive and it's just against an entire board. I qualified with Dom, so I was I was with the fastest man alive. You think that I was putting times anywhere near him? Of course not. Uh, they got 22 minutes left on the track, according to my clock. Do we know whether Dwy has 71 nose down set up? I'm looking at his turns. I don't think he does. I don't think any of these runners have 71 end down set up right now. Um, mark your bingo cards again. Commentators talk about 71 end down. Uh, nose down is how you charge your boost, and it starts charging at a little over 70% of the input. So um, you can get reduced turning radius. No, where, where's my words? 
When you hold nose you can... down, your turning radius gets wider, but it's percent based, and since you can start charging a boost at 70-ish percent, which we shorthand to 71, you don't have to take the full reduction of holding it at 100% nose down. So you can turn sharper and still charge boost. It's a little bit nuts. Essentially, if you're playing on PC, you can take advantage of virtual joysticks to set your nose down at exactly 70.01%. You're, you're trading off a bit of acceleration, exactly. but getting much better turning out of it. I don't know if it's exactly 70.01, but it is like very marginally higher than 70. Like it's barely noticeable by uh, yeah. anyone who would be doing rounding. Oh, we got a bit of a rage look back from Metallica. Was that just a bump up finger, I think? Well, uh, uh, Dwight's stream has frozen. Seventy point oh one with VJoy, slightly more with other configs. Thank you, Yam. Greater than oh, seventy, and it's a flow value there. on PC. Dwight has unfroze. Oh, Dwight has ref unfrozen. There we go. Metallica opting to restart. Has anyone set a time yet? Yes. Yes, Metallica uh, did. That's right. Dwight has a 551.908, and Metallic has a 514.085. Ah. So we're waiting on Leaf. Nope, Leaf has a has a 552.181. Oh. Great, I can just turn the timer up. No. <laughs> I was paying attention when the times rolled through the first time, but I like completely forgot what they were or if they came through. My brain just forgot that information as soon as it came across the screen. Fly coming up the mountain for lap two. Taking a lot of wide turns. Understand why he's doing that. You want to be safe. Right, right. I don't right. think Y is tilting as much as he ought to, though. When you tilt, you get a free reduction in, in out. Ooh. I'll just stop talking about Dwight guy now. I'm being mean. I'm, I'm doing bad things to him. <laughs> Digital, you have an entire results spreadsheet. I, ooh, you are correct. I could so just, just look at it if I, you know, used my eyes. So in just theory. looking at that results spreadsheet, it looks like right right now Dwy is is behind Knock, and so is likely to be eliminated from the competition there, Ooh. unless he pulls off you know the the best you know APC time in the world you know. Yeah, just casually world record on Endo Prime Centrum, it's fine. Leaf Green choosing to repair, understandable. It's uh, optimal if you have to repair to do it on those uh, those straightaways, I think, right? Because repair does sort of hamper your ability to turn slightly. And with, uh, with the already increased traction issues coming from being on PlayStation 4, uh, Leaf's going to need all the help oh. he can get. Goes over the lava, that's not good. He's been doing that every time. Not sure he knows. I mean, it isn't really instinctual, is it? Not really. You wouldn't expect to be heating up in an infinitely high updraft. Thank you, mm. KVD, for confirming what I said about uh, repairing on straightaways. All yellow engines, that is correct. Leaf Green is playing with fire. Metallica nice. is five forty three. Five forty three oh five by the looks of it. Could be an O four anything greater than five. Or it could be an O five low. Oh, 
We'll, we'll know as soon as Leaf Green presses X to advance. There we go. Still, as a relative newcomer, that's an incredible time. 4 8. Oh, 0, 4 9. Sorry, I, it, my screen is extra crispy. <laughs> yep. 543-049 for Leaf Green. That's that's pretty good. That's pretty good. That's actually better than I got in my in my time. Fire Mountain Rally is a an absolute bear. It is. It's yes. not a CRT in an underground bunker, Ronnie. It's just the comm stream is at like 720p and not upscale. <laughs> 480. 480? Ugh, gets worse every year. <laughs> Ooh. Oh, that's a nasty one right there. Yep, that's an upsetting crash. You should have, you know, I should have found that one for a short that I'm working on to try and explain texture kills. How many things can we mark off the bingo card today? I'm sure we can do another one. After all, it's it's May 4th. May the 4th be with you all. Right, right. Uh, texture kills are... Uh, it's a term that we use. It's not exactly an accurate one. Oh! Ooh. Oh, that's an upsetting, an upsetting death right there. That's just sad to be in the arena and die. Um, Metallica trying to take that safe cut shortly? Safe or, cut shortly? Safely. Shortcut, Shortcut safely. safely, yes. There you go. <laughs> It's not exactly a texture kill, more like a regular kill. That's true. It functions kind of similarly, though, because it's it doesn't seem to be treated as a wall so much as it is just a very steep floor. Um, but it lets me talk about it. So texture kills are uh, sharp changes in terrain that cost you just enough speed to put you over the crash cap, or at least that's the theory right now. Oh, no. 513.829 from Metallica. That is blistering. You know, maybe I don't need to do a whole series of informational shorts about the game. I could just talk about it during qualifiers and, you know, clip it. That'll be fine. That'll work out great. We are just over halfway. Looks like we're just past the 15 minute mark. Really? I got just past the 14 minute mark. Oh yeah, that's right. You start your timer with um, stream time. Yeah. So when yours runs out, that's like the actual time that the stream is going to move on. But when mine runs out, that's when I have to tell the runners no more resets. Got it, got it, got it. Got it. Uh, It is a blistering, a blistering time. Metallica might just choose to sit on that for the next few minutes, or could be getting the adrenaline out of his system. We're not sure. All the same, Ooh, almost a nasty bump there is a from Leaf. Crazy time. Metallica's going back in. Can we get it down to five twelve? Metallica had a 520 PB before preparing for quals. Oh my god. Oh wow. You know, just, yeah, just casually shaving seven seconds off during during qualifiers. No big deal. Not necessarily during quals, but like during qualifier practice, shaving it down that far. That's nuts. Ooh, Metallica resetting. Have either of the other two gotten a second time in? Oh, well, I'll look at the sheet. I'll look at the sheet. 
Bly's Fire oh, Mountain is still a 551 908, according to this. And who's our other racer right now, Balmas? Bly Guy, Metallica, and Leaf. Metallica, okay. Metallica still has a 513, that's the fresh one, and Leaf has a 543049, according to the tracker sheet. Leaf's on fire? Leaf's not on fire anymore. Oh, that explains why there's a delay. I'm looking at the wrong one. I'm like, huh, the stream got a lot clearer. And it's out of sync with what Balmus is saying. Don't worry, we, we can edit it out in post. Yeah, it did lightning. Lose the audio again. <laughs> Up oh, here's a shortcut from Leaf. Very and nice. It's clean. Very, Very nice. Clean. Ooh. A shortcut so clean I can see my own reflection. Why is on lap three heading through forest? Ooh, Ooh three reds. Oof. Four. Two of them are warning. That's what happens if you don't repair those. Warning damage will time out after about, I think it's 10 seconds, right? And it just detonates your number. engines. I don't know the exact number either, I can't recall, but warning damage will eventually detonate if left untreated. Hence, warning. Draco says five seconds, I see. It's always worth it to repair with Bullseye on a track like this if you really need to, because Bullseye's repair stat is cracked. Ouch, Leaf lost a lot of speed on that bump there. Oh! Right into the wall. Four warnings. Yeah, so uh, that's a little bit too many. That might be a couple too many. Oh! No. Back-to-back -back crashes from Dwight. You hate to see it. Yeah, that hurts. What's important, though, Both is all of our runners do have for leap. What was that? Uh, leaf went over the lava at, at high heat, and both engines caught fire at the same time. Ooh. Wish I'd caught that. Jeez. Oh! Oh, no, that bonk hurts. Oh, Dwight placed a time, but I didn't catch what it was. Uh, I can check the tracker sheet, because somebody's watching and keeping up, keeping that up to date. I don't know if it was faster. Dwight might still be sitting on that 551. He is, yes. He, he did a 556. Ouch. Oh, that's upsetting right on the last turn, too. Yeah, that would have been a 545. Unfortunate. Is it faster, though, is the question? No, he has a 543 already. Ah! Oh. Fire Mountain proving to be a slog today for our runners with eight minutes <laughs> left on the clock. This leaf is on fire, says the Bulldog. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> Five forty three sixty FPS console is pretty good. That is that is very fair to notice. Unfortunately, I'm not sure if the qualifier point system takes into account console usage versus uh, overall. Metallica going into Cheeseland on lap three and keeping his heat very high, very important on lap three. You want to maximize that heat as much as you possibly can. And with Bullseye, that is a bear of a task, given Bullseye's incredible capacity for cooling. This is true. Under underheating with Bullseye is very easy. I think there's only two other pods who have an easier time underheating, right? Toy and Slide, right? I think so. I I, I was thinking Slide. I didn't, didn't remember Toy. Toy cools pretty quickly, but I don't remember if it's 
that five twelve point two five, which is better than what he has. Holy crap! That's almost a whole second. That's more than a whole second. Five twelve point two six eight. Oh, that was sad. I looked down at Dwight's oh, screen just in time to watch a death in the waterfall. Metallica live cobalt buff. We got is some, he going to sit on that or is he going to get back today. in there? He's got around six, seven minutes to get it, to get that done if he wants it. I think he is. We're going back in, boys. Metallica Live Cobalt tie? It's not a bop? Oh no, it is a bop. Ronnie, don't get my hopes up. Ties are incredible in this game. They look cool. Uh, by real time, there's about 5 minutes 30 seconds left on the clock. Uh, by, by runner time, just add like an extra 30 seconds. Leaf continuing to go over that lava. I really think that Leaf just doesn't know about it. Which, you know, we, we talked about this already. It's sort of fair to not know about that kind of a thing for the lava. Yep. Still, that's just going to hurt his time. Yeah, it is very important to remember that this is not a competition between these three runners. They're all, like, qualifying sort of, like, semi-independently. They do all want to qualify, but it's not like any of them has to be better than the others in this, uh, in this particular forum. Broken up into pairs within a group for the Olympic the past randomized. Oh, that's neat. It's a fun way to do it. Uh, for those just tuning in, which I don't know if there are any, but we should talk about this just to be safe. Welcome. Uh, this is the way the turn of qualifiers work is we have a certain amount of time on the tracks to set a time. Uh, all of our runners right now have set times on FMR and are currently attempting to improve. Um, and you, you get your times, you get points based on how your times place you in relation to the other players, and eventually you may or may not end up on a bracket. Dwy Good guy coming your up on match, Trees Ronnie. Land, lap three. Let's see how he does. Not boosting a whole lot. It's going to underheat and pop. Ooh! Oh, nasty. That was upsetting. Uh, Dwy taking red damage in that corner? Yeah. Yeah. Slows down almost to a full stop there to make that turn. Taking these corners very wide for safety. Goof, I'm not sure if Dwy is deathless, and I'm not going to comment on whether or not Dwy is deathless, because if I do, Dwy will die. 549785, which is. I think that's uh, better. Check the, check the pad. <laughs> not quite. He had a 765 before. Mm, I think that's the time that he just got. Oh. He, he just said the time again. <laughs> Oof, that's upsetting. I think Dwight was on a 50 before, right? Like a 51? Two minutes left on my clock. About three on mine, yeah. Once again, to explain the timer discrepancy, mine is in real time so that I know when to tell the runners to stop making new attempts. And, and Bulbas has a streams. timer based off streams so that you guys know approximately when the last runs will be coming in. 
the runners are still getting the full amount of time to utilize. It's just a little confusing because we got two timers that are about a minute apart from one another. That's the power of the Home Depot. No, uh, of stream delay. All right, Leaf in Cheese Land, lap three. Let's see how they do it. Looks pretty clean so far, as clean as you can expect from PS4. Slowing all the way down through shortcut. Does survive. And that's going to be the hardest part of the lap. I don't want to well, say anything because uh, I want the. Oh wow, Leaf is on is on a really good pace there. Metallica might have uh, tilted slightly after that one. Uh, came in on a pretty good pace to uh, to end a lap and died immediately. <laughs> 539, incredible from Leaf. Blazing speed. Uh, I have only a few seconds left on my timer, so I'm going to let them know that it's uh, almost time for no more resets. Or rather, I will let them know there's time for no more resets in 25 seconds. And then you guys will get another lovely minute of watching their final attempts roll in. What were those last stitches? Point nine six eight, I think. I can't quite uh, tell. Because they should I be on screen right screen. now, right? No worries. Uh, nine five nine. All right. No more resets. Ooh, Metallica taking a bump off the arch and into the wall. I've done that before. It hurts. We'll be seeing the last minute of quals coming in right about now. Well, last half minute. It looks like Leaf is deciding to sit on that time. Understandably so. That is a good time to sit on. Metallica has made the jump to Ando Prem Centrum. Ooh, this is exciting. We're getting down to the last track. Is Metallica going to beat Nacho 3 for 3? This is what we got to know. All eyes on Dwigai. No pressure. We're just all staring. Why well, has learned his lesson from the last time he had warning damage. Choosing to repair this time instead of let it take him. Oh, no, oh, I just noticed that has a fish. That means that Metallica has officially beaten Hellfire's time for taking his place on, on, on that leaderboard. Oh my gosh. By around two tenths of a second. Hellfire shaking in their boots. The worst respawn for Dwy can confirm that was the saddest thing I've seen all day. Hellfire, you're not quaking in your boots, okay. Oh, come accepted on. my fate. Oh, come on. This is what Ben gets you, Hellfire. And Hellfire switched to Bullseye at the very end. Just, you know, the very, very end. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, Leaf going left path. That is not the path you want to take lap one. You want to take the middle path, which is slightly shorter. Uh, especially as a novice player, right? Uh, Wait, not the which left path? Right path. The, the, the path through the ice tunnels leading up to the up to the ramp. Oh, um, left path is actually acceptable. 
Um, because if you have trouble underheating on the uh, on the switchbacks going up to that ice tunnel area, the left path is acceptable because you can actually hold the boost. It's in that weird pocket where if you're new to the game, it's slower. If you're decent at the game, it's faster. And if you're good at the game, it's slower again. Ooh, it's really weird, nasty. like, thing. Dwai guy slowed almost all the way down for that shortcut. Unfortunate. Still better to take it and live than to try it and die. And a 554 for Dwai, which is not an improvement. All right, looks like Leaf is off. And so it begins. Metallica going the long left path, which is slightly faster if you can hold the boost, which he does. Well done. Very well done. Very well done. Leaf being very ginger in that chicane, understandable for a new player. Jump through the funny bridge that has no collision. And here, the PlayStation, I believe, is doing some some other some other stuff with the traction, making him have a long, a, a shorter jump there because of the higher gravity. Yeah, it'll do that. Traction is, for whatever reason, used in the gravity calculation, not the other way around. Well, maybe the other way around. I don't know the math on that. LP, confirm or deny, are they both used in each other's calculations, or is it just traction is in gravity? 52, 9, 7 for Metallica's first lap. Very good time there. Choosing to take the left path, which is, again, slightly shorter, but much more consistent, which you want in a tourney, especially in a, in a banker time. Ooh, nasty. Nasty bonk there. Why coming out of city on lap two, heading into final downhill. Sniper clocking a 55 dot something. Crunchy screen. And here again, the PS4 is really harming Leaf. Yeah, yeah, those you, you need that low traction to make that chicane. Ooh. Uh, you can see Metallica employing a very clever trick there uh, by holding the slide button over that little hump in the city section. Metallica is able to maintain a boost that would otherwise launch him into the air. Mm-hmm. I do love Ando Prime Centrum just because it's such a visually distinct track. It's the only city track in the game. It's got so many different distinct routes you can take. Oh, Leaf finishing a lap, 245.54. Dwight finishing a lap. I missed the time there. What was that? 47 dot something. Dwight was flying through those menus. I didn't catch it. 45.541 for Leaf and 247.250 for Dwight. Thank you again, Goofbrush. Put that in the tracker sheet. Um, Metallica still to submit a time, I believe. TV. And for comparison, if Metallica wants to bop Nacho, he needs to beat a 236.852. Did I, get the, did I say that right? If Metallic wants to bop Nacho, not the other way around. All right, focus. There we go.
All right, Metallica coming up on the end of lap three. Let's see what he can do. Flame finish with the, oh, not quite a flame finish, but 236.09. 236.092 by the looks of it, right? Is that how that reads? 093. Which means that Metallica has sequential. officially bopped Nacho Bredo. Three on all for three. Tracks. three. Oh, somebody beat me to the punch. I was going to put that in. <laughs> I am so sorry. I just cracked every bone in my knuckles on my uh, on stream. <laughs> sorry if anybody hates that sound. Ooh, do I getting a bad bonk through that chicane there? And losing the boost, that's unfortunate. Oh. You don't want to see that. A very sad thing to see. I... I cannot control my neighborhood, I do apologize. I can't hear anything, honestly, so you're good. Ooh, that was a risky hop over that wall there. I missed it, I was looking at Dwight finishing up a third lap. For 242. 242. He's 242 menuing something. too fast. 242582. 248.44 from Leith. It's right, there's a. Fifty one point nine from Metallica on work? lap two. Oh, oh, corn. And... Wait. I'm going to just stop touching the tractor sheet. I'm trying to help and I'm making it worse. It's, it's a little hard to remember what to say while you're watching this. Sorry, Goof, I didn't mean to screw everything up. Metallica coming in for a final lap now. Or coming up on a final one on lap. that second lap, too. That was a good, a good second lap. 55 for Leaf. Fly coming out of city for second lap as well. Metallica taking that curve a little bit wide. Understandable if you want to be safe there, but you need to cut that cut that close to be faster. Again with a boost hole, very nice. Just past seven minutes on my timer there. We're almost halfway through, over halfway through, sorry. Just about. Ooh. And a very nice 235 from Metallica, incredible. Oh boy. 235.864, very nice. Saving seconds, hand over fist. Leaf Reed taking some bobs, but maintaining a nice speed through that chicane there. Ah, but they're losing it now because the, because he's underheating. Oh. Ooh, that's a fun one. Oh, wow, everybody's crashing. Ooh, another time for Leaf Green, 243.55. 
which is a two second improvement there. Very nice. Looks like a 5, 4, 8, or 9. Again, crunchy screen, can't tell. Ooh. Metallica going over the Triangle of Doom there. You can crash there. I, I always win seeing someone take that turn. Uh, the image looks sharper on PS4 because this is an HD... Uh, port sorts. Uh, it's using upscaled text and upscaled graphics in some places. Oh. It it does got weird font. It's got very weird font. I think one of the problems is I can't tell. Is the PS4 text italicized or not? It doesn't look like it. It's. It does have a very slightly different font, but it, it's more it's more that it's it italicized less. How to put it? It, it, it looks like PS4, it's not italicized as severely. The PS4 is 16 by 9 natively, whereas in order to get the 16 by 9 aspect ratio on PC, you either need to stretch it or the tournament will stretch it for you if you're playing in 4 by 3. No. More red damage for Dwai. Beautiful execution of that jump by Metallica. And the boost and hold. getting the city boost hold again. Oh, it's a pleasure to see that every time. It is. I was just about to say, it's like, it's so nice to see these high level racers walk and just be amazed at what they can do. It's just satisfying. Exactly. Just put this back on and I can fall asleep to pod racing ASMR. You casually fall asleep watching the tournament VOD that you commentated. <laughs> Well, not right now. The sultry sound of your own voice two hours later. Uh, there is no HD PC version. However, we do have some uh, slight modding that we can do to get HD fonts available, uh, as well as repaired textures. But we haven't run across any of those in our qualifiers today, I don't think. This is something fun that happened recently, was uh, we finally managed to realize why all the textures only look good on N64. Turns out, some files must have gotten corrupted very early in the process. Oh, that's a beautiful turn from Metallica. Lovely. Leaf Green is coming up on the end of lap three in the city section. Holding it together, but it does look like the undersle underheats slightly. Mm. Undersleets itely. Good job, words. Very well put together. All right, looks like a 246? No, 247. Is that, I think that's slower. Can't tell if that's an improvement. It is slower by four seconds, yes. Ah. Why guy coming up on final lap? Oh, that's interesting. Dwy's only like one second out of sync with Metallica's stream thereabouts. Yeah, just so about. These, these two are like, oh, well, that's where they're going to start separating. 
Oh, that's time. Yep, 30 seconds on my timer. So these are look like, looking like the last runs. Unless somebody crashes in the next 20 seconds or so. The last runs indeed. We'll be seeing them rolling in over the next few seconds here. 236 flat for Metallica. Which is not as fast as the 235 he got before, but still very nice. There's a 241 something from Dwy there. Uh, I'll check the tracker in case it was faster. I think it was a 241. And Metallica getting a, getting a nice last set in, right under the n nice buzzer beater of a run. Ooh, that damage there on the Triangle of Doom, though, being very risky. Ooh. Uh, not, uh, but... 5188 on lap one. Are you kidding me, Metallica? That's incredible. Yes, the times are very close compared to Fire Mountain Rally. This is a much more uh, routing and lines oriented track than FMR. It's also a lot easier. <laughs> it's a heck of a lot easier, yes. Metallica coming up on the end of lap two. Fifty two ninety five. Well, that's interesting. I hadn't noticed that. Uh, there also seems to be an interesting thing going on with the earning of the final lap text on the PlayStation 4 as compared to the PC version. Like, the letters are just further apart. Hmm. True. That's kerning that that's called, right? Or spacing. I, I don't actually know. Kerning, tracking... The spaces between the letters. Oh, hey, why look at is that. after my own heart? Why is absolutely after my own heart pulling up Fud Sang on the uh, <laughs> on the inspect vehicle screen? We love to see it. Two thirty five nine seven. He's that Close. faster. No, he had a 235.8 before. Still, that's an incredible time. Welcome, one and all. <laughs> Welcome. That was some incredible racing out there. Congratulations to all of you. Yeah, thanks. It was fun. That was, that was something. <laughs> did everyone get their personal best? <laughs> uh, I did for AQC and FMR. Congratulations. We'd like to see you in that community here. It was... Yeah, I was a little, a little nervous at first because I like, I don't know, reset three, four times, but I'll take two PBs back to back. Very nice, yes. Oh. Metallica, congratulations oh. on bopping Nacho Bredo in all three of your tracks. <laughs> nice. Damn, good there job. <laughs> some fast pod racing there, huh? Some very fast pod racing, blistering <laughs> speeds all around. That FMR time was insane. Yeah, see, that's why I wanted to play on the 4th of May. See, it was for good luck. <laughs> I think you're right. I think you're right. <laughs> I, I have to concur. And what better <laughs> way to spend a May the 4th than with this? <laughs> right. Indeed. This one, I won't be forgetting for a while. That Ando Prime Centrum was also very nice. A lot of clean decisions all around. Um, Some nice, nice lines. Yeah, Definite nice buzzer beater. Pretty attempts. safe on that one. <laughs> Yeah, I know, I know I did the quick reset there, but I mean, I was hoping for the hat trick with the personal best, but APC, that's fine. I wasn't feeling that great about it anyway. Hey, it, it happens sometimes. 
I mean, I did come in with one second of my PB, so I'm proud of that time. That's yeah, so can't good, though. Can't complain there. Can't complain there. Definitely can't complain about one second of your PB. That's pretty close. Yeah, second and a half, if I'm being completely honest, but... <laughs> We upsell, we upsell. <laughs> upsell, yes, digital. Yes, how could I forget? And Metallica, looks like on Fire Mountain Rally, you didn't just bop Nacho, you also bopped Hellfire, so well done there. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh, oh, Hellfire. <laughs> uh, it would have been pretty amazing if we managed to pull off the, the time with Bender, but uh, that's a bit of you know how tournaments work. It's bad for him, but it's really good for me. <laughs> <laughs> Absolutely. So it looks like with the brackets as they stand, Domare is first, Kuro is second, and Metallica, you're actually in third right now. Thank Congratulations. You. Congratulations. Nice. <laughs> work, Very dude. well done. Thanks. Of course, that might change, but I'm hoping that it doesn't. Yeah. I'm rooting for you. <laughs> might change yep. in like the coming weekend, maybe. <laughs> <laughs> might change in about uh, six days. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> yeah, there Six are so days. many good runners left to qualify that uh, I yeah. don't even know if I can keep a spot in the tournament. There are so many nuts qualifiers this year. Absolutely insane. I am so looking forward to it. Congratulations well, to all our runners today. I hope everyone had fun and uh, good luck in the future tournament. Yeah, it was yeah. a good experience. I'm glad we could all get together and do this. Indeed. Really nice to have you all here, especially you, Dry Guy, because I. I think you were my very first uh, opponent in the 2019 tournament, so yes, I always remember time, you so and good, see. Good racing with you. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> the friendliest grudge match of all time. <laughs> <laughs> well, until next time, everybody, this has been our Galactic Pod Racing Championship qualifier match between Leaf Green Sniper, Metallica 5167, and Dwy Guy. Uh, until the next time, keep your goggles on and your engines tuned, everybody. And may the force be with you. There you go. <laughs> Always. <laughs>